been on YouTube, I want to say almost two years now. And one thing I've learned from starting a YouTube channel and reading a lot of comments, talking to a lot of different people is that a lot of people don't have like an eclectic taste in music, a wide range of music. Um, they like stick to the genres that they like. They grade music typically by genres like, oh, uh, I mainly just listen to, to metal and heavy metal at that or progressive metal or R&B or hip hop or insert whatever. They might have two or three genres they bounce from. And what I've learned is that no matter what genre it is, it's hard pressed for me to not be able to find us, find a song that I like in that genre. Now, of course there are some genres where I'm like, I, pre I pretty much can't get down with anything here. Like I struggle a little bit with, um, industrial metal, but most of the metal genres that I've heard, I can usually find a band or a song that I like within that genre. And today I'm reacting to a song that I actually discovered from a folk reaction that I did and I was in the mood to hear some new good folk music so I usually go back to the comments section and I read the comments and see what people are suggesting and I discovered Sierra Farrell in dreams uh, in the comments section I never did a reaction but I would probably say this particular song that I'm about to react to might have been in my top played songs like if you if I looked up the top 50 songs I played last year on Spotify over and over again well actually this one I like this live performance better than the Spotify version. But yeah, I absolutely adore this song. I think that it's an amazing track. So we're going to be reacting to this. Um, it is not a first listen. I love this track. Absolutely love this track. If you like this type of content, do me a big favor and like the video. If you want to stay up to date whenever I post, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Let's get into it. Let's go. Oh my God, I'm tuning the wrong peg. Oh my gosh. <laughs> there's, there's not a time where I don't hear that opening melody where it just doesn't pull me into the track. It's like, it's just right from the beginning, a beautiful riff or melody. You guys know I'm not a musician. Uh, that's whatever you call that. I never get tired of hearing this song. I really, typically when I'm, when I'm listening to this by myself and in the forerunner, I'm geeking out like I'm listening to Jay-Z's The Blackout. Okay, I just love the way this song was written. I love the melody. Uh, I know it's just getting started, but let's keep it going. Oh my God, I'm tuning the wrong peg. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> She was like she was spitting the verse here. OK, and let's talk about that voice, the way it sounds here. This is way better than the version on, on Spotify. Just this organic version here. I get chills as soon as she starts singing. She has an amazing voice. I love you, honey, and you look so tired. I know it's hard with bone into this life. One day we must die. But then a river will flow Bobby and 
just the guitars, all right? Then I walk into the room and then you sit. Then you sit, you're so alone and quiet. Well, I can't help but stare how I love you and it just ain't fair. Sungbird, just an amazing melody. All right, just beautiful, beautiful. Can't say I can't say it enough. Here we go. Won't you take me with you before I'm gone? Ooh. you have a voice when you give yourself goosebumps all right and i had that through most of that track as well i'm really curious what you guys think of this song you know is this something that you would listen to what you were, you were already familiar with i know some people are just uh -uh, you know what i mean because the you know the guy he looks like one of those you ain't from around here type <laughs> you know he he has that stereotypical southern look look to himself you know like uh you can tell that he has a six-pack behind him somewhere you know um but uh, i'm vibing to their music i, I loved it uh, and would definitely love to check out more from from her i didn't go through her catalog this is just a track that i stumbled on from one of you if you remember the person that made the comment you know you can let me know in the comment section here if that was you uh, but yeah, you threw a gem to me and this happens all the time. This is just one that I, I, I made a video about, you know, I'll read the comments and then someone say, you will absolutely love this track. And I have to decide whether I'm gonna do a reaction or whether I just listen to it. And then I end up fall in love with the track. And this song I've heard well over a hundred times, 200 times, who knows, you know, so um, I know that I know this track like the back of my hand, but it, there's nothing about it that I did. I don't like it's, it's right up there in the folk bluegrass whatever this is you know not, i don't like all of it but there is a lot of it that i love and i love when i find a great gym this was a gym um anyways appreciate you guys for watching you know if you like the video do me a big favor and like the video if you want to stay up to date subscribe hit that notification bell all that good stuff i appreciate your time as your time is very valuable hope you have a great day peace